This is amazing. What if you can use Gemini in your own Node.js application using its API? What if you can analyze image using Gemini Vision Pro API? That's exactly what we're going to see today. Let's get started. Hi everyone, I'm really excited to show you about integrating Gemini into your Node application. I'm going to take you through step by step on how to do this. But before that, I regularly create videos in regards to artificial intelligence on my YouTube channel. So do subscribe and click the bell icon to stay tuned. So the first step to integrate Gemini API to your Node.js application is to generate API key, which you can generate from Google AI Studio. You can click the create API key in new project if you want to create a new project. If you already have an existing project in Google Cloud, you can click this icon. Keep a copy of the API key, which got generated just now. This is required to run the application. Now we are going to install .env from npm. npm install .env and click enter. Next, npm install at google slash generative hyphen AI and click enter. This is the main package which is required to connect with Gemini model. This is how my package.json file will look like. A type model and the dependencies are .env and generative AI. Next, export your Google API key which you have just generated here and then click enter. Now we are going to create a file called app.js and then open it. Inside the file, import Google Generative AI from Google slash Generative AI. Next, import .env from .env. Next, .env.config. This is used to retrieve the API key. Now the first step is to define Gen AI new Google Generative AI and then pass the Google API key. Next, we are defining the generation configuration, the temperature top P, top K, and the max output tokens. The second step is to initialize the model. Model equals generative model and passing the model name, which is Gemini Pro, and then the generation config. And third step is to generate content. So in this, we are going to create a function called generate content. And the question we are going to ask is create a meal plan and send this prompt inside model.generate content. Then we will receive the results. And finally, we are printing out the response. If there are no response, then we are mentioning that as an error. And finally, we are calling that function, generate content. That's it. You initialized Google Generative AI and passed the Google API key and defined the configuration. Second step, you initialize the model using get generative model. And third, you ask question, create a meal plan for today, and then finally print the response. Now we're gonna run this code. In your terminal, node app.js and then click enter. And here is the response, breakfast, lunch, dinner, snacks, and that's it. Now we are going to add Gemini Pro Vision to analyze image in this code. We're gonna change the model name, which is Gemini Pro Vision. We are going to import file system, import promises as FS from FS. This is used to read the image file. Next, we're going to make changes in this area. I'm going to delete this. First, loading the image, reading the file, and converting that to base64. Next, we are sending text and image. It's a multimodal large language model. So we are going to ask and describe what the people are doing in this image and also passing the image. This is how the image will look like. We are going to analyze this image, what people are doing in this image. And finally, we are passing the parts variable to the generate content function. Contents, a role, user, and then parts. This is where you input your text and then image. And finally, we are getting the response and printing out the response. That's it. We just import the image, convert that to base64, added the description and the image to the generate content function. Now we are gonna run this code. In your terminal, node app.js and then click enter. And here's the response. Two men are playing cricket. The man in the foreground is the batsman and the man in the background is the wicket keeper. That's it. As simple as that. Now you are able to integrate Gemini large language model both text generation and then image analysis vision API to your Node.js application. I'm going to create more videos similar to this, so stay tuned. I hope you like this video. Do like, share and subscribe and thanks for watching.